He weighed in at 210 pounds. Fighting out of Vodasta, Georgia, and training at the X3 Sports. Make some noise for Darian Perry. His opponent tonight, fighting out of the blue corner. He weighed in at 204 pounds. He trains at True Strength in Atlanta, Georgia. Give it up for Jeff Bacon. All right, here we go. Welcome to NFC 79. First fight of the night, we got Darian Perry with an 0-1 record from X3 Sports taking on Jeff Boykin. 0-0 record out of Victory Martial Arts. We got referee John Kofer set to get things underway. Here we go. Uh, I think Darian might take us to the ground coming out. We'll see though, just a hunch. Expect some karate from Jeff Boykin coming out of Victory Martial Arts. It's a karate based oh, gym. There's wow. that hook kick. That was almost right on the chin. I would expect Darian to shoot here soon. Yeah, I think he's gonna throw a couple punches and shoot, but we'll see those long kicks, he's, the side kicks he's throwing. It saw, keeps a guy from shooting. Saw Darian's last fight from Conflict. Showed a lot of success with the takedowns and grappling in the first round, but just got caught in a submission, it happens. If Jeff throws that left high kick, I think he might find money with that. Nice side kick to the face. Not much contact, but he touched him. In amateur MMA, we got three three-minute rounds inside the NFC cage. Nice inside leg kick from Jeffrey. Yeah, Jeff's just picking his shots. Oh, there's Darius there's shoots the in, but and he dumps him. Wow. Nice takedown there. Uh, turning him to the side saved him from that guillotine because he was in there. Right in the side control for Darian. See what Darian has here on top. Showed a lot of success in his last fight with the jujitsu on top, but got caught late in the first round. Let's see if he's made some improvements. He's gonna avoid that this time around. He's got a really good side control here. He's got his base out. He's got his knee blocking the hip, keeping him from shrimping out. But let's just see what he does with it. Oh, he looks like he's going for a mount and gets caught in half guard. <coughs> Darian on top now in half guard. Again, no punches to the face on the ground as an amateur until both competitors have three fights or more. Yeah, Darian's got Jeff down in his corner. He's uh, listening pretty avidly to the instruction of his corner. Coach is telling him to step over and pull that knee out. Yeah, it looks like he's trying to slide over to Mount. Nice body punches. He's got to be careful. He might get swept here. Oh, and those are some hard body punches. Jeff starts to get up. He's looking to step over into Mount, though, and he does. Excellent job from Darian Perry. Wow, huge pressure here. Got him pinned up against the fence right in front of his corner. Looks like Jeff might get out of this. 10 seconds left here in round number one. Again wow. in full mount from Darren, and he's gonna rain down some body shots here to end out the round. Pretty big first round there from Darian Perry. Yeah, uh, Jeff Winkin got some good kicks off, but uh, I think they're gonna give that to, to Darian just for more control and that dominance on the ground. Just depends on what the judges are looking at, what day, you know. All right, here we go, round number two between Darian Perry versus Jeff Boykin. Darian Perry ending the, end the last round in control on top. Oh, oh, Jeff comes in with a big right hand. Darian reverses, looks like he might be in a guillotine here. Oh, does he have it? Oh. Darian's stepping over, he's trying to, he's doing the right thing to get out of it. Oh, he is out of it. Yeah. Sorry, yeah, I couldn't quite tell from where we were sitting. He almost stepped over to the wrong side there, but luckily he got his head out. Corner of Darian calling for the mount again. 
Now, in amateur MMA, what do you, which do you prefer without strikes of the head, going to mount or side control? Um, honestly, I think the best position is either side control or the back, because those are going to be where you can set up more attacks. I mean, guys can really defend in the mount when you know, they don't have to worry about strikes. Agreed. They can just sit there with their elbows in. It looks like Darian's moving to mount here. Yes, he is. He has got full mount here. Darian Perry with full mount here in the second round. Showing really dominant grappling here. Yeah, it's looking like the grappler versus the striker here. Oh yeah, definitely. I'm surprised that uh, I haven't seen too many scrambles or, or jujitsu from uh, Jeff here, other than going for those guillotines. Darian throwing down some right hands. Jeff just trying to cross face his way out of this situation, but again, that's another thing. When the person doesn't posture up for strikes, you don't really have room to move. You just get smothered until you make a mistake. Now he's postured up. This is where Jeff gets a chance to get out. He just can't shake Darian off, man. Darian just too much for him on top. Again, kind of getting caught in a stalemate here. If punches to the face were allowed, you better believe he'd be throwing down right now. But unfortunately, due to the rules, it kind of turns into a jiu-jitsu match. So just punches to the body. Yeah, Darren came with the with the better jiu-jitsu today. That's, that's obvious here in the second round. Oh, yeah. Jeff is just trying to find a way up. And it uh, looks like he's about to give his back up here in a second. And uh, just as I say that, Darian moves to the back. Coach is calling for the rear naked choke. Let's see if he can get it. Yeah, he's only got one hook in here, but he still might be able to go for it, Jesse. You never know. Ten seconds left here in round number two. Can he get it here with short time left? Looks like he's just going to throw down some punches to the body to end out the round. Two rounds, Darian Perry. Zero rounds for Jeffrey Boykin. Yeah, Jeff Boykin showing a lot of fatigue. He gets smothered by a younger guy, able to use his weight. You have all that muscle on your upper body. Say goodbye to uh, keeping your hands up and having much resistance. All right, here we go with round number three. UFC uh, vet John Kofer reffing the fight here between Jeff and Barry. I'd like to see Darian strike. He's got the guy tired. His reactions are going to be slow. He's going to be worried about the takedown. I want to see Darian let them hands go. He looks really light on his feet here. Yeah, I mean, look at Jeff. Look at how he's flat-footed. There's not much bounce. And Darian Perry, this is a guy that can make 185 for sure. Oh, dude can make 55. Just missing with that jumping roundhouse kick. Oh, and Darian gets the takedown here. And yeah. You gotta be careful with those spinning techniques against somebody who wants to take you down. Yes. A split second of taking your eyes off your opponent. Your gosh. Darian's in kind of a weird position here. Yeah. That doesn't look comfortable, but it looks like he's looking for a head arm choke. Oh, he moved right in the mouth. Smooth as butter. Jeez, excellent pressure here from Darian. Darren's just gonna smother him here. He's got his elbow in his face, cross facing him. He's maybe setting him up here for an arm bar. Looks like Darian Perry wants a finish. Yeah, that's how he punches him until he gets his back up. Exactly. Yeah, looks like he's almost there. Jeffrey looking for a guillotine, but from that position, it's pretty much impossible. Darian slips his head out with ease. And there's actually the Von Flew choke from the guy on top from that position as well. If someone goes for a gate team from there. Oh, geez, hard body shots. Yeah, he's just trying to get him to get his back up. Jeez, these are some vicious body punches from Darian. Ground and pound. God. 
dominant control, smothering him here on top and just landing vicious body oh. punch. Look at these donkey fists. Wow, it's hammer time. Jesus. He might get a TKO stoppage if Jeffrey doesn't start defending himself. That was intense, Jesse. Jeez. He went full MC Hammer on him there. Oh, and here ah, he goes again. Look at these body punches. Wow. Those just sound very painful, even to block. We're going to get a right good left. shot to the solar plexus there. Ten seconds left here in round number three. Looks like Jeff's just going to survive his way to the end of this fight. but That's going to be a 30-27, if not more, unanimous decision for Darian Perry out of X3 Sports. This fight was all Darians. All Darians. Darian Perry, with that performance, is going to pick up his first mixed martial arts win. You know, Jeff, Jeff showed a, a lot of good fancy technique, but you, you're stepping into an MMA fight. You've got to come in here with, with good ground game because that is 70% of the fight. Yeah. We go to the scorecard. First fight tonight, give it up to both of these guys. All three judges score the fight. 30-27 for your winner. Fighting out of X3 Sports. <laughs>